Sanjita Tiwari from IG Institute of Engineering and Technology from IG Access Department. I am going to take a session from the subject that is Model 4, from the subject that is Comptivision, 3171614 is the subject board. Model 4 name is Segmentation. Basically, we are going to do the topic that is Normalized Cut. This is the last topic of this chapter. Starting with Normalized Cut. Basically, we are talking about the different normalized situations that have been arised in particular objects when we are cutting it off with respect to the boundary position. So here the normalized cut, we can say about why we are taking the bottom of merging technique, that is aggregate region into the coherent pole, and we can say the mean shift technique that try to find the clusters of similar pixels using mode finding, the normalized cut technique introduced by the Shi and Malik examines the affinities between the nearby pixels and five to separate groups that are connected by weak affinities. Suppose we are considering a graph as shown in the figure. I am showing you the graph. The pixels in group A are all strongly connected with the high affinity, which we can say as the thick red lines which I am showing you in the group and in the figure. As the pixels are in group B, so the connections between these two groups, where the group A and group B are defined with the thick red line, which is connected strongly. Now, as been shown here, the connections are being shown here with the blue line, which are much weaker. Uh, the two of the lines, which is formed as a red line and the thick blue line. Okay, so normalized cut between the two of the groups, we can say when we are grouping, when we are merging, we are making region with respect to the pixel position, with the pixel combination. A normalized cut basically between the two groups, shown as here, will be with the respect to the dashed line, which will separate them into two clusters. Now, whenever we are talking about the two clusters here, as you can see, one cluster is there and two clusters is there. Now here the cut which is being taken place between the two of the group pixels like group A and group B, here the line is being defined with respect to the connections between the two of the nodes. So here the simple weighted graph as its normalized cut, cut, we can say that a small sample graph and its smallest normalized cut. Now the tabular form of the association and the cut for this graph, as you can see here, the associations and the cut entries are composed which are known as area sums of the associated weight matrix W which is defined with the formula that is with the matrix form here as I am showing here with the group A, with the group B, with a group A, with group B the four of the combinations the A cos, the cut form, the cut form, the associated form so we are having two of the operations or two of the functions for the particular normalized cut that is association and cut so association, associated key we can say with respect to A with A or A with B ok so here the cut is being taken place with respect to A and B so cut is defined with the two parameters different that is A and B but associated key is defined with the variable of the same position itself that is A to A and B to B. So here the associations with respect to the vertices which I have defined in the graph as shown here that is A group and B group is defined with respect to the graph that is association and cut. Now the sum is being made with respect to the all the vertices which have been taken place with respect to A. Okay, so the associations and the cut entries are composed as area sums of the associated weight matrix sub. Now the cut between the two of the groups A and B is defined as the sum of all the weights that is being cut. So here the cut formula is defined as the cut A and B which is defined with the sigma which belongs to I. I is the variable which goes from 0 to N and J is also the variable which goes from column that is 0 to 1 or 0 to N. So, I belongs to A and J belongs to B with respect to the weighted that is weight of IJ where weight between the two pixels for the regions I and J measures that similarity. So, using a minimum cut as a segmentation criteria, however, we can say that the result is not, does not, uh, is being not matching the reasonable cluster since the smallest cut usually involves the isolating of the single pixel. So, a better measure of segmentation in the normalized cut which is defined as here as n cut that is normalized cut with respect to the two regions with respect to a and b values. So n cut a and b is defined with the cut of a and b which is defined with the association with a with vertices plus cut of a and b with respect to association b of vertices. So this is the basic formula where we have the segmentation of the normalized cut is being measured. Okay, so where we can say associate that is a a which is equal to p which in where i belongs to a and j belongs to a. So, width of IJ is the association that we can say sum of all the weights within a cluster and the association AB associates with the AA and AB cluster, which is the sum of all the weights that is associated with nodes, same with respect to 
So these are the normalized cut equations that we get whenever we are forming the two of the groups and we are cutting it off. So here the figure B which I have shown you with respect to the table shows how the cuts and the associations can be thought of. Where the sum is being defined, that is area sums is defined in the weight matrix that is W. Where W is defined by type A form. So where the entries of the matrix have been arranged so that the nodes which are coming in A will come first and the nodes in B will come second. But of course, the nodes A and after the nodes B. With respect to that only the matrices have been made. The figure here will, is showing you the actual weight matrix for these sums may have already been computed. So the dividing each of these areas by the corresponding row sum, the right most columns of the figure B, that is the resulting in the normalized cut and the association value. So these normalized values will better reflect the thickness of a particular segmentation since they look for the collections of the edges that are weak relative to all the edges that is both inside and emanating from a particular region. So sample weight we can say table and its second we can say smallest item vector that is she and Malik has been used that is shame sample of 32 cross 32 weight matrix that is double which is defining the correct measure of whiteness and blackness with respect to the parameter area. Here the eigenvector that is corresponding to the smallest, it is the second smallest eigenvalue of the generalized eigenvalue, which defines with the equation that is D minus your W with respect to Y, which is defined with the lambda function of D of Y. So this is defined where the sampling is being take place, where the gray scale is being measured with respect to each and every picture, which is defined for the value of 0 to 2 percent. So with respect to that, we are finding the eigenvector that is lambda and putting the lambda in the equation and we are getting the sample position and then we are plotting in the graph. So this is what the weighted of the graph is being measured in the normalized cut. Unfortunately, we are talking about the computing. So the computing the, mo the maximum, we can say normalized cut is NC complete that we are taking as a technique. So which is instead, we can say the Sheehan Malik which is suggested computing a real value assignment of nodes to groups. So let x be an indicator vector of where xi is equal to plus 1, that is if i belongs to a and xi which belongs to minus 1 if i belongs to b. So let suppose we are calculating the distance between the two of the rows. So d is equal to w1 which is the first vector, is the row sum of the symmetric matrix of w and d is the diagonal d which is being corresponding to the diagonal matrix. Now, the Sheehan Malik which has shown that minimizing the normalized cut over all possible indicators that is factor x is equivalent to minimizing factor which is defined by the minimum value or the function parameter minimum of y, y of t into d minus w into y. y of t dy is the parameter which is being dividing off with this way. So this is what the function is which indicates vector where y is equal to 1 plus x minus d into 1 minus x divided by 2 is the factor which we are corresponding putting into the function. Okay, so corresponding where all the ones and we can say minus b value such that the y dot d becomes 0. The parameter becomes constant which becomes to 0 or we can say it becomes 1. So here we are taking the concept of d. Minimizing the ray length that is question we are relating here with respect to dy. So it is equivalent to the solving the generalized Eisen system that we are having it. It is defined with the formula which we have already taken here that is d minus y into w is equal to lambda, the parameter that we have taken it with respect to d. So this is what the generalized eigenvalue system is which can be turned into a regular eigenvalue which is defined with i minus n into z is equal to lambda z. The z is the parameter which we are taking with the eigenvalue problem. Now here extending the idea originally proposed by the Scott and Long suggest normalizing the infinity that is matrix and then by using the top k vectors which constitute a true matrix. So other people have extended the basic normalized cut framework which is by modifying the affinity matrix in different ways finding better discrete solutions to the minimization problem or we can say multi chain technique we are applying here. So the figure B shows the second smallest real value like vector that is corresponding to the weight matrix shown in the figure so after this, real valued vector is computed, the variables corresponding to positive and negative eigenvector values are associated with the two components. So this process can be further repeated to hierarchically we can say subdivide an image into a figure as shown here. Okay, where the each figure is being taken place and the part is being taken with respect to the grayscale. Here one part, another part, third part, fourth part, 
fifth part, sixth part, and seventh part. Here, the cut is being taken place depending on the two of the regions or three of the regions where we are taking the bisection. Okay, so this is what the original algorithm, which is defined with the image, is having the formula that is W of IK base is equal to expression Fi minus Fj whole square minus Xi minus Xj whole square upon tau r square or tau f square, where Ic is defined by the 1 minus maximum power of so where I L I J is a image line joining pixels I and J and the peak on that is X is the probability of an intervening point of perpendicular to this line. So figure shows the result of this improved algorithm and here the everything is being defined with all the quantum algorithm probability. So an example of the segmentation produced by the weighted aggression that is W A is shown in the figure as we have already seen and in the even more work which is defined. So this is what I have talked about the normalized factor and the normalized cut that is being taken place with an interaction.